Okay, so this is a hangout on the on the server here. If we can uh, show you. Yes, honey. He's gonna growl because that's what he does. So I just kind of want to show you. So I did finally hear from um, the baby daddy, and this is sadly, very sadly, how it went. Here we go. It's just really pathetic. So it's just why people just contact you to bring you down. I don't know. But he just clearly states how little he cares about his kid and how not guilty he is for what he did. So I contacted him back in 2019. I don't hear anything. Last year, actually. Okay. And then a year later, out of the blue, this week. Oh, hi, Tara. Save your energy. Oh, hi. Oh, hi, Johnny. Like fucking Tommy Wusso, right? Save your energy. I'm not thinking about you. The child. The signs are there, but I get it. You and your son matter. Trust me, that's wonderful. Assuming that that's what you want anyone to think. What the hell? Not trying to make you feel more or less. That's not true. You're trying to make me feel less. Not interested in this you, quote unquote, thinking for everybody else stuff. I don't even get it. Go ahead and gaslight. Who else would it be? Go ahead and gaslight. Declare exactly where we all stand. Why no one will ever consider helping you. G G. Which I'm pretty sure is reference to Gigi Allen, which is weird because that's a conversation I just had in a hotel, which how could he know that? Uh-huh. Pretty fucking weird about Gigi Allen, who was like this punk rock guy with a really small dick. Okay. I have no idea what you're on about or why you bothered to contact me. I'll just... This is me. Um, if it's just to pull me down, shove it. I don't need or want that from you. Take care and go hide yourself. You guys don't stand. You all kneel to your own discretion. Indiscretions. Your child should have child support. That's all I care about. I don't care about what, about everyone else. I don't know what you're on about. I care about him and myself. Your family can go rotten hell as far as I'm concerned. No one is playing at altruism here, at least to uh, all of you. Grew up, pay up, or get out. I never deserved this, this shit you pulled. What's the thing you want, Joseph? Behind all the convoluted garbage, oh hi bullshit, like you just ran into me on the street, point blank spit it out, what do you want? You listed what you don't want, I know. I know how you pull this shit. So what do you want? Your gonads back, probably under your mom's boot flap. Check there. Sure about that, hi there guy, haha. Ha. So here's the deal, your child and I moved out of state. If you want to confirm that he's yours, paternity tests are over the counter these days and I'm down to comply with whatever when it comes to that you won't because you aren't because then you're a monster and you can't uh handle that you right to tell me that you aren't thinking of me haha <laughs> okay whatever here's the thing since i know the counties that you wish to reside in my case workers are alerting the police there shortly of for non-payment of child support that's just the way of it i'm not down to lose my benefits because you're selfishly buying drugs for you and your horse not my deal not my problem since i have no proof that you're complying outside the system and since they do have proof that you're ignoring the warnings and paperwork that's what it is doesn't matter if you are staying in Sonoma we both know the cops all know you by first and last name there is that what you wanted when you say Gigi are you referring to Hannah <laughs> remember because she was a man <laughs> still funny still funny still funny you fucked the guy and you committed to him and you told him that you loved him. <laughs> Still funny. I'm sitting here wondering about attachment. I wonder the cause and remember the things I once loved about you. I feel guilty for even remembering as if remembering makes me weak. Um, fault or wrong. How could I have ever loved a man who left me and his son to die? How could I have ever loved a man who cheated me? Um, who cheated on me with a teen? How could I ever loved a man who wasn't capable of loving me at all, who never asked one question about myself, who was incapable of being real, who took up the toxicity of his mother to have that relationship over hours? Gross. In particular, this one truly disgusts me. And, uh... 
truly disgusts me and the most memories of your mom and her wizened vagina flashing do. You told me a long time ago that in the end I was going to look at you with tears in my eyes and say, how could you do it? What you did. You weren't even there, man enough to show up to my face to do any of this. But it's true. Whenever I look at your son, I think of what you were doing to him, and I feel that. I'll never forget sleeping with a knife guarding my pregnant stomach while you were gone. I know you, how you push all things out of your mind and don't serve your feelings of self-worth or entertainment. I know how little loyalty you have for any women. I know that all the girls you swore off and poised you tried again to recapture, and I know that I left it all, that if if left to do it all again, you would. I'm sad so many years have gone by, and you are only further from God. I pray that one day a reckoning will happen, which will shake you to your core and awaken your fragments of your soul. The Joe I love doesn't exist anymore. You killed him, and as you killed, as you killed us all. And for that, I don't even know if I can forgive you. I know... You seek to cause me only pain when you contact me. I know you will dodge child support until you are caught. 18 years is a long time to run. Out of principle, I have to seek legal forces to get you until you surrender, until justice is restored. I love our son for the best that he is. He is whole. He is complete. He is simple and pure in ways you can never force yourself to be. The, the need to God is the only way you will have and die, you will live and die without ever having truly tried it. I do not wish the same fate. Take care and please leave me alone. I know you only wanted to die. LOL, dude, you're such a narcissist. Okay, he clearly doesn't understand the word. No clue how I missed this and got mad before. Tell me more. I'm about to go to bed. No cable. Keep going, dude. I love it. I said, you're mean. Just stop, Donovan. Your double speak doesn't work on me. Nah, I'm bored. Tell me about myself or what I'm doing, like a narcissist does. <laughs> there is nothing heartfelt about you anymore. Look at you, spoken like a true narc. Don't you have a mirror to grace or a woman to underwhelm? Come on, dude. The first message was funnier. Don't react. Put more thought. Okay, Donovan. Why did you even bother to write me? Do you gain... What do you gain with this systematic torture? Like, seriously, what's the get-off? What did I ever do to you? Like, seriously. LOL, alright, I tried. LOL, whoa. Uh, did you ask me a question you don't know the answer to? Going to bad nighty-night. Like my dad said, if you understood a crazy person, you'd be crazy. I didn't know meth slept, huh? See, I'm learning something new. Drink up, buttercup. Bad people have to drink to sleep. Nighty-night, your son is storing. The simple pleasures you choose to never know. How pathetic and sad. And sad again. How sad and pathetic and sad again. I'm going to kiss his forehead because I can. When was the last time you kissed one of your kids' foreheads? Oh, right. That's right. Baby Donovan can't take care of his baby. His mommy says it's not allowed. Oh, baby Donovan. Do more drugs, Donovan. Go on. It's worth it. Do you have do you do lines off your mom's stomachs? Does she spoon feed you your meds like the other Glen Ellen clients, medicating and maintaining? What a life. Did you ever get that proof that I was a drug user? No. What a shame. Just what's up, Bap? That's what I fucking thought. Satan fucks. Listen, Don Don, until that day comes where you take a knee repenting to God, you're just a waste of time. There is nothing sacred to you. Until that day comes where you can care about your son more than you care about yourself, there's no point to. LOL, do this again. Oh, you poor thing. Still believe I cared I cared all that work I did to see my own boys mm -hmm. acknowledging that my son is his son. A kiss good night. I don't know what I'll do with myself without it. I guess I'll just be here to live with the guilt. Ha huh? LOL. This is a good one. Wow, so proud of yourself for the monster you become a are you crazy or medicated? Getting my dick sucked right now. Although he's bored about to go to bed and the cable's out. Getting my dick sucked right now. His mom and him must have a fucked up relationship. <laughs> Laughing at you had no point. You're right. Yeah, right. Kind of a turn on. Must be shithead if you're typing while doing it. What, no teeth this time? LOL, Tara, baby, tell me something more that's pretty fucking hot actually oh is it because hannah had four removable teeth keep going 
Ah, uh, what kind of bitch would give head while her man is typing? Is it a tech nerd thing? Are you at Comic-Con? No, Donovan. We both know the last time you got came from me. Deny it's fine, but you lie about everything, and I don't believe you. I was just talking about how I overcame getting head with my girl. Such a lie, dude. And you sent me this message. Crazy coincidence. He's so weird. It is crazy. Okay, Donovan, have fun. Thanks, babe. Remember how Hannah was a man? Remember how you're also typing to someone else during this convo? Because I could see he was typing. He wasn't doing anything else. Because he, it shows you when someone else is typing and then they go away and typing go away. It means either they're talking to someone else. I mean, it's a good one, Donovan. Remember your mom's gray pubes? Talk about sexy. Sure you know more about it than I do. Sex is so easy. So, so easy. And then, what? And then he blocked me. So, here's the reality of Donovan. Um, and um, I'm just going to show you. Um, And just to be clear, this is is from his email. Shodan Kessinger. Okay. Um. The same one I've been writing for. writing that he had like lung cancer and stuff okay 